morning everybody well i wake up to see this from west wally and well this is just uh, me playing it and showing how the guy concedes that gravity doesn't make gas go down go boom boom oh boy g'day everybody where's wally here well i woke up to this this morning from my old mate flatsoid seems flatsoid wants an apology from me uh, 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 where's wally i'm still waiting for you to um back up your lie about me you see guys where's wally made a lie about something and i've asked him to back it up and he hasn't backed it up yet maybe we should go and show everybody what he lied about this is his lie guys went back it straight away that's a lie when did i say that bs why lie since you made this statement and claim an outright lie which i never said i would applaud you to go and show where i made that statement please no no where's wally i don't need to read anything further I would like you to show where I made that statement. You said specifically, I agreed with you that the rocket moved before it hit the walls, which is an utter lie. Everybody can see live now what a liar Wes Wally is. Uh, yes, I did disagree with you. I'm busy disagreeing with you now. The rocket does not work in space. The idiot doesn't get when he shows a na -ah and sticks it to the sky. Says, you see, I see a rocket going in the sky. That rocket has conservation of momentum. Is that rocket already moving, guys, when it leaves the ground? <laughs> the rocket leaves the ground and it goes up. It's moving, correct, as far as I know? Of course. So when it gets to that low-pressure environment, it's already moving. Nah. I don't agree with you at all, Wally. But I do want you to say where i made that statement because it's bullshit and a lie exactly. so where's wally's a liar mm -hmm. uh, where's wally no the rocket did not the, the, the syringe did not move until the smoke the gas hit the container wall get with it stop making shit up so i want you to come and show everybody where i made that idiotic bullshit claim which i did not make <laughs> where's wally what did we just say is it already accelerating no that's all right. allow me to apologize i assumed that you had watched and understood my entire video debunking you and level earth observer clearly you had not that was my bad i assumed you knew i was making the point that the second rocket shown by action lab was easily seen to move prior to the exhaust contacting the edge I did also address the other less important issue of the gas going everywhere inside the chamber. Now you made a whole video about the secondary point, but didn't touch the main point at all. So I did the thing that parents often do to a naughty child that lacks self-awareness. The parent reflects the child's behavior back at the child to see if they like it done to them. So I did just what you often do and inferred concession of your position based on your lack of response. And guess what? You got very upset by it. So kudos to you for feeling how you make others feel when you do it to them. Now I hope you modify your behavior in future. Now I ask that you go to 10 minutes 15 in my Leo and Flatsoid video and watch how the second rocket does move prior to the exhaust stream reaching the edge of the chamber. So again, I am sorry. I assumed you had watched the whole video. I should have realized that you were just cherry picking the easy parts and leaving the inconvenient parts aside, just as a true flatsoid would do. Now, if you doubt my backed up claim that the second rocket does move prior to the exhaust touching the edge, then please show this live on your show. Grab the two frames from the Action Lab video, one when the exhaust is first visible from the syringe and a second frame just before the exhaust touches the far wall. Now, do your best blink test overlay of those two, please. Just like you do to Dave McKeegan's photos. We know you're able to do it, so let's see. Now, be sure to use the part of the Action Lab video where he zoomed in slightly. This will give you the maximum accuracy. Timestamp of 5 minutes and 32 seconds. Then, after you've done that, you can apologize to all your viewers for misleading them into thinking that the rocket didn't move. You really do need to research harder, mate. And perhaps you can work on that bad habit of yours of inferring a concession. Just like you did at the start of your video to me just last evening. Thanks, guys.
Morning everybody, well I wake up to see this from Wes Wally and well this is just uh, me playing it and showing how the guy concedes that gravity doesn't make gas go down go boom boom oh boy